हेलो स्टूडेंट्स नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द कलेक्शन एंड प्रोसेसिंग ऑफ क्रूड ड्रग्स राइट सो दिस इज द टॉपिक व्हिच इज देयर इन द सेकंड यूनिट फर्स्ट इट सेल्फ इट हैज गिवन कल्टीवेशन कलेक्शन एंड प्रोसेसिंग ऑफ क्रूड ड्रग्स राइट सो बेसिकली व्हाट हैपन इज स्टूडेंट्स दे विल बी प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर कल्टीवेशन कल्टीवेशन मेथड टेक्निक्स एग्जांपल्स बट एट द सेम टाइम दे विल नॉट कवर द पोर्शन कॉल्ड द कलेक्शन एंड प्रोसेसिंग ऑफ क्रूड ड्रग्स बट when it will be asked in exam they will find difficulty to write the uh, to explain the things with the example so that's what uh, the completing of this portion also it becomes very important right so just you be there with the video and you will find the so many examples in the easiest way so that you will be able to e remember it in the exam point of view right so uh, well, let's say uh, start with the video like uh, collection and processing of crude drugs right so after collection crude drugs required to processed prior to marketing it's not that anything if you are harvesting like for example ginger right so ginger if you have taken it for one ton you have cultivated and you have harvested it so after you have collected it and now you have to process prior to market you have to remove the earthy matter you have to remove so many unwanted thing which is there along with your crop or along with your medicinal crude drug right that has to be done so uh, what is the reason of this processing the reason is to stabilize them in transport storage right during the transportation there may be the so many vibration though so many types of uh, shaking it is going to take place if it is liquid drug if it is some types of semi solid and during storage also temperature ph so many things it is going to there are so many scientific fact which it which is which is which is involved along with the crude drug and they are going to change so stability is very very important and also the reason is to ensure absence of foreign organic matter and substitutes right if anything has been mixed knowingly or unknowingly that has to be uh with uh, 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 that has to be removed properly that's what processing is important and uh, foreign organic matter if it is there during the collection that also has to be removed otherwise they are going to contaminate they are going to degrade they are going to change their medicinal values right they are going to reduce their loss their uh, therapeutic property that's what it's very important to process the crude drug these are the reasons right that you like that you can uh, start your answer so let's have the some very good examples uh, so that we will be able to understand like what is the things why it is important when we talk about collection it's a, it's looks like a very easy collection collection of crude drug but what are the examples you are supposed to give in which way that's important without example your answer will not be considered as a fulfill or informative answer right so when we talk about first point you are going to write the collection type of crude drugs what we are going to collect and the area of collection where it is being collected these two are major factor in the collection right so uh, what are the things how we can explain this it should be skilled labor right it should be used uh, that the, the particular uh, those who are going to collect they have to be skilled labor trained for the purpose like if it is, if it is the digging of the potato ginger rolfia root underground drug or maybe any leaf senna vinca so they should know about entire part of the plant which they are going to collect and how they are going to collect right so they, that's what it should be trained or a skilled person okay example in early stage the plant don't produce active constituents that knowledge should have the with the per, skilled person hence age of the plant is very very important for example mentha it produce pulgon p u l g o n e in early stage whereas this mentha mentha piperita it is going to produce the menthol in the matured stage so if you are expecting menthol you should not collect the mentha leaf in early stage only pulgon you are going to get you are not going to get the menthol if you are expecting menthol the menthol is very important active constituents which will be there in the mentha and that for that only the people they will cultivate right so the person those who are involved in the collection they should know that in the mature stage only we are going to get the menthol and we are going to isolate or extract the menthol that's what right second the diseased plant or treated with the pesticides are avoided like sometimes in the even in the green leaf vegetables whenever you are going to the market or right to bazaar you are expecting you are purchasing sometimes a pala kura tota kura right so if it is be uh, recently if it has been pesticide had been spreaded over there and if it will be collected and it will be sold you are going to eat the pesticides and ultimately it is going to uh, cause the cancer and so many other problems right so that's what diseased plant which one is diseased one they will show by some by some color changes some spot some kinds of uh, uh things it is going to be there which will be abnormal so it means the plant is diseased and we are not supposed to collect 
सीजन ऑफ द कलेक्शन इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर एग्जाम्पल रूबार्ब इफ यू टेक द एग्जाम्पल ऑफ रूबार्ब रिस्पेक्टिव केमिकल कॉन्स्टेंस एंड वार्मर सीजन ओनली तो रूबार्ब वॉट एवर द केमिकल कॉन्स्टेंस विच इज रिस्पॉन्सिबल थेरापेटिक एक्टिविटी दे आर गोइंग टू गिव द इन वार्मर सीजन ओनली सो वार्मर सीजन ओनली वी आर गोइंग टू कलेक्ट इन अदर सीजन इफ यू कलेक्ट यू आर नॉट गोइंग टू गेट दोज कैंड दोज पर्टिकुलर टाइप्स ऑफ केमिकल मोइटी इन द प्रॉपर कंटेंट ओके नेन नेक्स्ट राइजोम एंड अंडरग्राउंड प्लांट्स एवेन वी टॉक अबाउट फॉर एग्जाम्पल राइजोम मीन्स जिंजर देन रॉल्फियर रूट एन एक्सेट्रा कलेक्टेड वेन एरियल ग्रोथ राइट तो एरियल पार्ट सो बिकॉज दीज आर द अंडरग्राउंड राइट सो अंडरग्राउंड मीन्स एरियल पार्ट्स द अपर पार्ट इफ इट इज हेज बीज एम बी ग्रोन प्रॉपरली दैट विल बी द इंडिकेशन दैट द अंडरग्राउंड पार्ट इट इज रेडी टू हार्वेस्ट लीफ एंड फ्लॉरिंग टॉप्स वॉट वी डू जस्ट बिफोर दे रीच देयर फ्लॉरिंग स्टेज राइट वेन एवर दे रीच देयर फ्लॉरिंग स्टेज दैट मीन्स द लीफ इज मैच्योर्ड इनफ नाउ टू कलेक्ट एंड दे विल बी हैविंग ऑल द एक्टिव क्वेश्चन विच वी आर एक्सपेक्टिंग फॉर एग्जाम्पल इन सेना सेनोसाइड ए एंड सेनोसाइड बी सपोज टू बी देयर डिजिटलिस डिजिटॉक्सिन सपोज टू बी देयर विनका विन क्रिस्टीन विन ब्लास्टिन सपोज टू बी देयर बेलाडोना एट्रोपिन सपोज टू बी देयर सो दीज केमिकल्स विल बी प्रेजेंट वेन एवर वी आर गोइंग टू कलेक्ट वेन द प्लांट विल रीच देयर फ्लॉरिंग स्टेज दैट्स क्लियर examples is very important you have to give the example by giving this heading and if you go to the book you will you will get in the paragraph wise and it will be very difficult to understand what to write what not to write so these are the key words you should remember in the exam so that you will be able to write by in your own word or in the uh, you can have the more information flowers when we talk about just before pollination before their full expansion we can collect them right like saffron flower or in maybe the clove birds right so when we talk about the barks right so in this kinds of way in this way you can present your answer like bark what are the important things we are going to have here when we talk about bark early summer when cambium is active right so in the bark you we know that uh, there will be the wood and uh, there will be the bark right so here the cambium is portion where it will uh, increase the growth towards the bark and towards the wood right so in this early summer when the cambium is active it is easy to detach them from the stem right so this bark it will be easy, uh, uh, easy to detach from the wood okay uh, that's what uh, then feeling tree cut at base and the bark uprooted uprooting root are dug out and the bark stripped out then copying scopicing right so plants allowed to grow for the definite period and cut off by the different tools right so like that we are having certain way to collect the bark and all other uh, constituents which is responsible for the food drug right now when we talk about the fruits right so whenever uh, fruits are also having their uh, uh, own indications when they are uh, we are supposed to collect so either ripe or half ripe fruit can be collected but fully grown it has to be grown then only we can expect some chemical moiety for example cardamom is the fruit that is elaichi right bell fruit or tamarind imli right so these are after full maturity only they are we are going to get the uh, constituents which is responsible for therapeutic purpose caraway fennel coriander fully ripe it is required right if it is ripe fruit then only we are going to get the constituents right unorganized crude drugs when we talk about uh, there are so many types of unorganized crude drugs we have discussed already in the another video resin gum latex uh, collected as soon as ojos ojos are out from the plant all right and if acacia 2 to 3 week after in season on bark when whenever we talk about opium and papaya so after coagulation of latex only we are supposed to collect so there is certain point the time is very important here time season and uh, then only we are going to collect then we are going to expect the uh, different types of uh, what do you call this thing active constituents now harvesting is very important how we are doing when when we are supposed to harvest the particular uh, medicinal crop that's important actually people forget and they will leave this portion but when they will start writing they will not get the content to write that's what it is important to listen properly and the go through right and for harvesting skilled worker again it is required it is not like a normal crop like rice wheat or sugarcane right we should have some knowledge about that the particular person anyway with the experience they will get they will, there is no separate course for this but even though it should be skilled one adulteration to be avoided 
because adulteration if you have seen that uh, unwanted uh, material similar looking substance it is going to be mixed by intentionally or unintentionally by the collector so it will be uh, definitely affect the uh, therapeutic property of the particular medicinal crop or crude drug mechanical devices can be used under for underground uh, drugs like rhizomes or roots right so for that we are using the diggers and lifter right so nowadays you can see in the uh, different operators equipments uh, advanced technology has been involved right so for uh, root rhizome and tubers we are uh, thoroughly washing in water and remove the earthy matters and then only like ginger so ginger or potato if you are getting it will be it has definitely there will be the earthy matters will be there that has to be washed properly with the water then only it can be uh, go for selling or storage right uh, when we talk about flowers seeds and small fruits right by special device like seed steepers stripper right seed stripper can be used right for clove beating plant with bamboos then clove buds will be separated from this uh, from their uh, main parent plant right then apart from that we can have the agar right agar by long handle forks can be used peppermint uh, normal method with mowers we can uh, cut it down right peppermint like different mowers will be there right like this right so this can be useful okay then uh, fennel and coriander we can uproot and dry it so in that way we are going to collect these particular things right so with the uh, crude drug example if you write the answer it will be easy to uh, impress you and easy to remember for you also now after collecting after uh, this thing we are going for the drying that's very important drying means what we do in the drying before marketing or preserve for long time drying is important right so removal of sufficient moisture contain of crude drugs that's important the moisture contain which is there that has to be removed otherwise it will attack fungal the fungal growth will once i started you are going to lose the active constituents and again it will be problematic nobody is going to purchase you will not be able to sell it right improve its quality if you remove proper moisture content the quality will be maintained make it resistant to the growth of microorganism especially fungus right in, in it inhibits partial enzymatic reaction which is going to degrade your crude drug that's what right so when we talk about drying there are two types of drying natural drying and the artificial drying right so when we talk about the natural drying uh, it may be by the sunlight sun drying right dried sunlight direct sunlight can be used for drying if volatile principle shade drying supposed to be done otherwise all the volatile oil will be exposed when we talk about artificial drying there are tray dryer vacuum dryer spray dryer in tray dryer which do not contain volatile oils they can be subjected to tray dryer and which are sensitive to the high temperature we have supposed to use the vacuum dryers here vacuum pressure it is going to be applied and the drug is going to dry spray dryer means high sensitive to the atmospheric condition we have to spray dryer we have to use and we will uh, remove the moisture at sufficient quantity so that drug will be maintained safe now the the fourth important point you can make it uh, here that is the garbling right so garbling is nothing but dressing after drying removal of sand dirt moisture organic matter has to be removed extraneous matter that's what it in in, in short we can say extraneous matter can be removed removal by several ways it has to pass pharmacopoeia limits the limit test has to be done uh, how much percentage of things supposed to be there what uh, why, how much percentage of foreign organic matter according to that monograph or pharmacopoeia limit only we are going to have then only it will be sell into the international herbal market or in the herbal market right packing so what we can do is uh, uh, aloe is packed in goat skin right so that is the one more thing colophony and balsam of tolu kerosene teens we are going to pack it right so packing is very very important here uh, then apart from that uh, we can have the uh, asafoetida in case of asafoetida if it is there well closed container can be used cod liver oils we are going to use the sensitive to sunlight because these oils are sensitive to sunlight so that that's what it should be stored in such a way such a container which will not have effect of sunlight right so the container should be light protective it, it means to the sunlight protect right senna and vinca it has to be pressed and built properly then uh, digitalis ergot and squill 
very sensitive to the moisture and uh, they are costly also that's what special packing it is required uh, right so with these examples uh, you can write uh, so that you will get the and you try to underline those things whenever you are writing so you will get the good marks right now coming to the storage and preservation of crude drugs actually this is the main thing right sound knowledge of the physical and chemical property of crude drug if it is honey castor oil kuchal monger oil or maybe latex or maybe uh, acacia tragacanth or raulfia ashwagandha whatever the drug what is the physical and chemical property of that drug that it should have well closed container first of all it should be waterproof sometime fireproof sometime rodent proof any rat rabbit or uh, insect cockroach and all those things should not attack some days some drugs absorb moisture definitely by the atmosphere 25 percent increase weight by the when that they will get their the weight is going to increase and uh, imperme uh, imp impairment of in quality is going to happen enzymatic reaction is going to take place and which will decompose of active constituents for example digital is leaf right it is going to decompose by the absorbing moisture and increase the weight so that's what we have to take it in proper moisture zone whenever in storage radiation is another factor they are going to destroy the chemical constituents uh, for example ergot cod liver oil and digitalis right so by radiation they are going to spoil they are going to lose their chemical moiety right so in this way we can have the uh, so this is the uh, main theme of the uh, particular uh, storage condition and uh, processing of crude drugs so in this way by giving the crude drug example you can give the answers so definitely you will get the good marks thank you all the best